Hello, everybody, true. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beverly Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day. It is Tuesday, it is fall, Halloween is here, well, almost here. Guys, can you believe that parties are going to start this weekend? I literally have already a, a Halloween party this weekend, another Halloween party, two Halloween parties next weekend, and actual Halloween, okay? Which here in West Hollywood, they do one of the biggest Halloween parades in, I, I think it's in the United States. Like, it's huge, and it has been canceled for the last, since the pandemic. And this year, they are bringing it back again for the first time. So I'm like super, super excited because if you have been watching, bitch, you know that Halloween is my thing. Okay, I love to dress up. I love to have a good time. I I haven't repeat ever a costume like in my life. So I'm super, super, super excited for Halloween. So let me know what you guys are doing. Okay, guys, so let's talk about Vanderpump Rules a little bit because people are coming for Tom Sandoval hard. Like, they were like, not today, not today. You know, they were really, really upset with Tom Sandoval again. And you might be asking, what is he doing now? Well, you know that Special Forces is, you know, right now on and the last episode like rough a lot of people the wrong way okay <laughs> some kind of test he has to have some kind of conversation with uh people i i honestly haven't watched the show i just like watch the clips but uh, and so I, I don't really understand what is going on but just based on this i kind of like want to watch it now you know but anyways as he told this whole weeping story about what happened with Scandoval and he was crying and being sad and like the same bullshit as over. Okay, so let's let's hear some of the things that he had to say. He says, I have got a lot of thoughts going through my mind. I have had a hell of a past. Like three months, the like three months um okay it says the embattled vanderpump rule star setting a cliff from monday's episode of special forces sandoval continued crying while telling former special forces officers billy billingham and jason fox about how he had a month-long dialance with his co-star while still dating his longtime girlfriend ariana maddox and he says, I just, it, it just was the perfect storm. Like my publicist had never seen anything like it. Fucking reality star having an affair on CNN. It's so stupid. He said through tears. It became this Team Ariana thing. They sold $200,000 in merch in like two weeks. The Bravo Liberty also admitted his struggle with people he's been friends with for well over a decade, turning on him, referring to several of his co-stars and former friends. It was just so exhausting, he emphasized. However, neither of the decorated military members was having any of Sandoval's confessions aside and look away from him. And they told Tom Sandoval, if you want to play the victim, it makes it look pathetic. You are not a victim. You created this. I think the whole world is screaming at the TV. I, everyone was like applauding, you know, at that moment. But the people on the X, girl, they start coming from Tom Sandoval because it is so clear that he is still not taking any freaking accountability. You know, he still sees himself as the victim on this whole shit. I, I mean, look, the narcissism of everything is that he will never admit that it was his fault. He will always be like, I'm so sorry, but we were going through this. But we haven't had sex. But she wasn't that great of a girlfriend. But she never bought batteries. 
You know, like, it's always going to be kind of like an explanation because he is not, he will never be able to take accountability for any of this. You know, and I think, I don't even know if this show is going to really break him into putting to his mind what he needs to do. And look at some of the comments. I mean, these are insane. This is coming from X. He said, or someone says, oh my God, he had the affair and created the whole situation and he's whining that Ari and Katie made money from merch. That is so petty. He has no tears for what he did to Ari and Rachel. Only tears because he got bad press. Another person says, at least the British dudes told him he was pathetic. Another person says, he always cries, so nothing new here. LOL, pathetic. I don't believe anything he says. I wonder how big his win is. <laughs> Another person says, he is so insincere, it's wild. Another person, LOL, his acting is pathetic. Another person says, bitch, please. Before he got caught, he was already lining up his story to make Ari look bad and how he had no choice but to find comfort with Rachel because he was a victim. Remember, a narcissist is two things, a hero or a victim. Another one says, same all, same all. He plays the victim. My girlfriend was not sleeping with me. Boo-hoo. F off, Tom. I still hate you. Another person, typical Tommy, it's about me. I'm the victim here. Shut the F up, you narcissistic fool. Girl, it's like, you know, sometimes... I, I see these people and I will be at least lie, you know, at least lie on camera. Why are you being so stupid, so dumb, you know? I mean, look, it's, it's, if you don't mean it, why keep having the war against you? I mean, how dumb is he? Do you, do he, I mean, I think he really believes, I mean, of course he believes that he's a victim, but I think he really believed that playing the victim car will get him any sympathy. You are the most hated person in America. Like, girl, be smart. I don't know if, 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 the, if the mushrooms fry his brain or all the weed or I don't know how many drugs he does at the same time, but like, bitch. And I don't know what his PR team, what the F is like doing. I don't know who works with these people, honestly. like. I don't know. I think, well, I remember, I mean, I think, he, I don't know if the same PR of him and Rachel and Erica Jane, like, I don't know if all of them do the same PR, but it's like, someone needs to be fired because this is just too much. Okay, so, uh, let me know what you guys think on uh, the comments below. I mean, are you still, are you feeling bad for Tom Sandoval? Let me know. And if you want to get all the tea related to Vanderpump Rules or any of the other Bravo shows, Make sure to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.